It would appear that the inmates are now running the asylum. This morning, after the city was justifiably shamed for not doing their jobs in Lavac, our building was vandalized by a city employee. Make no mistake, this was a deliberate and planned attack, and we now have far bigger fish to fry. This employee waited exactly one minute until we left our building this morning. They were giving the illusion of clearing the pathway between downtown and the rest of Lavac. Remember the same 1311 said they don't maintain? As soon as we left, he proceeded to take out our community box, which is well within our property line. This serves as a food pantry or a toy library for those that need it or want it. It has been there since the fall of 2021 with no issues. In absolute anger, he dragged it into the roadway and left it and all of its contents in the road. This is the level of service we get in Lavac. A complete and total F.U. We were notified by residents as to this vandalism, and on our return, we saw this operator in Onaping. As I approached, he greeted me with, what now? The anger was palpable. When I asked if it was him who damaged our box, he said, it's in the f way. He gave us the middle finger not once, but twice as we left. This employee needs to be terminated. He also damaged one of our four pillars in, in his insanity, and these two will need to be replaced. I have no more leeway to give when it comes to this abuse. Not only the abuse so visibly shown on ourselves today, but the abuse of our residents in general. What he couldn't have known is that we have a variance for our front yard, which extends almost eight feet and like that wasn't good enough, we were recently forced by building services to get another variance that extended 17 feet, so into the street for our six foot balcony. That's another story of, of abuse of power for another day. In the meantime, the city will be dumping money into this vandalism instead of providing us with anything meaningful. That being said, this is to serve as notice that this employee has no business being anywhere near my building. When you know better, you do better. Shame on the city.